Okay, it is June 14th. We are in the mudroom. And the spackling has begun. A lot of changes have happened. We walk into our bedroom. As you can see, a lot of spackling has been done in here. Ceilings. And that little hole there is our smoke detector. So, here we go into our closet. As you can see, a lot of seat belt. As you can see, a lot of things have been moved into here. Here's our bathroom, which I gotta be honest, looks a little small, but I, I, I get it. I understand. It's actually not as small as you think. <clears throat> because before, um, I'm actually gaining square footage in our bathroom, which is kind of cool. So, um, here goes the niche. The niche. Our little bench right there. And our shower head above, which is kind of cool. And we're gonna walk. Actually, let me turn the lights off here. There. All right, here we go. Walking through, walking through, walking through. Boop. All right, here we go. Coming out of our bedroom, down the hallway. And we can see into our bathroom. Looking good. No real changes. Pretty big closet, actually, which is pretty cool. It's kind of like a new room. And then we are in. The kitchen. A lot of this has been done. Um, and for anybody who's ever spackled before, God darn, there's a lot of spackling. Um, I think that right now, actually today they finished our service, our electrical service. So now we are fully up and running <clears throat> with electricity. See the multiple um, outlets, which is nice. Uh, just to kind of show you guys, a bit, uh, to me, a big thing that changed. So we created this, we didn't create, Mike created this ridge here. And you see right here is the actual vent. And remember that from other videos, goes all the way up to the ceiling, okay? And vents out the hot air from the grill or from the stove or the oven and stove. So anyway. Looking good. We'll be back tomorrow.